Hey guys, what's up? It finally happened! Someone made a video game about me. More specifically, a grid-based strategy RPG about me. <laughs> like how cool is that, huh? This guy, um, he's from Argentina, his name is Sebastian. And of course, I'm gonna leave a link in the description to his YouTube channel and also to the game itself so you guys can download it and play it for absolutely free. You can also donate to this guy if you want to, if you want to support the guy who created this game. He created this game on RPG Maker, if I'm not mistaken, and today we're gonna find out together what kind of crazy idea he came up with. That is the Vortex Dimension, also known as Cleft of Dimensions, of Chrono Cross. So this guy included a lot of music from several RPGs, uh, some of them among my favorites, like thank you for that Sebastian and thank you very much for doing this game. Alright, so, wow, I love that song. And he knows that, and you guys know that. <laughs> Alright, so let's do this, let's begin with new game. That's from Suikoden 2. The whistling. Oh, look at that. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> look at my face, man. That is a very old picture from, I think it's 2017. Well, I definitely look much older now, don't I? <laughs> oh, man. So, uh, this is the room where I live, apparently. That is a very nice room. Some, some packages there, some boxes. That's a nice bed, looks comfortable. What's up with that doll? I mean, there's a Super Famicom in there. And a PlayStation 2, awesome. What's up with that doll? Okay, <laughs> so that's me, and he says, So, let's continue with the book. I guess I'm gonna be the voice actor. The voice actor, I mean, that can't be, can't be any other person other than me, right? So he's going to the book and the computer. Hmm, seems like I almost fell asleep when writing the book. What was the last thing? Oh, yes! I was writing the scene where they reach the beautiful landscape with a waterfall and... Okay, here I go. He got it right, I am a writer. <laughs> Later that night... Well, it's a bit late, I should go to bed. <laughs> or maybe write a few more pages. Yawn. <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> Okay, what's going on now? <laughs> Psst, hey! What's that, Navi? <laughs> hey, come on! And now he... Well, me, I am in a completely different world, medieval... I'm in an RPG setting. And this beautiful blondie girl with green eyes says, wake up. Why, well, I just landed there, I just appeared out of nowhere there? <laughs> My portrait changed. To, uh, this is old as well, I think this is where, this was from a 2017 com anime convention, I believe. <laughs> I look pissed off in there, like... <laughs> Let me see if I can try this make, to make the same face. I, can't, I don't think I can. What? Where am I? I see, so you drink a bit too much, right? Okay, he meant to say, so you drank a bit too much. There are some grammar mistakes here. What? Who are you? I am Elid. Or Elid? Elid? I'm, I'm gonna call her Elid. I don't know the pronunciation. I'm Elid. I was searching around here for some information and saw you sleeping over here. You carry such weird clothes. <laughs> what? My clothes are weird? Because I'm all dressed in black? And that book, well, I was curious about you. Oh, she was curious about me. <laughs> when am I gonna ever meet a girl that, you know, just comes to me out of nowhere and says, I'm curious about you. And a, and a pretty one at that. What the hell happened here? I see what you did there, that's a reference. <laughs> I was on my house uh, writing the book and then I dozed off? This place doesn't, doesn't sound okay. This place doesn't look familiar. I'm gonna have to correct <laughs> the text. I even have my book here. This doesn't look like a dream at all. It feels quite real. 
Hey, what a nice book that is. The drawing there looks cool. Did you use some sort of magic to draw that? <laughs> I, I'm probably carrying, you know, the Reaper's Thorn. Magic? Now that you mention, the people here do look weird and this bar looks way too old. Is that a the bunny girl there, the, 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 the waitress or the hostess, the bartender? Is that what, like a reference to Dragon Quest? <laughs> hey, you look super lost. Did you get hit in the head? <laughs> I probably did. No, I feel good. No hangover at all. Can you tell me where we are? Well, I'm a bounty hunter and this place is co Come outside and surrender! Damn it, those ass hats! They ambushed me. <laughs> ass hats. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> Alright, what's going on here now? That's also from Sweeter Than Two. The music. Those cowards! They are here again! They must be looking for us since then. Let's give him a hand, Jess. Jess is the brown-haired character down there, I guess. So this is a top-down view, greed-based strategy RPG. We better fight or we are toasted. The tutorial. <laughs> you can use the mouse to select the character's actions, use arrow keys to move. Z to select, X to cancel. Alright, here we go! Battle start? Yeah! <laughs> it's your turn! Oh, this is the menu? <clears throat> okay. So, uh, okay, Jess, El Elite, Renzo, <laughs> Renzo. Should have been called Resnor, like, in, like as in Trent Resnor. <laughs> okay, what do I have equipped? Book, helmet, cloth, and boot. I'm a reader, not a writer, reader. <laughs> All right. Let's move my own character here. Art. I have a metal song. <laughs> Make your allies rock. Attack up. <laughs> That's awesome. So uh, the the green area is where the area of effect will take place. Huh? Okay, let's do that. It's above them all. Nice. Art stone, fire burst, awesome. Nice. <laughs> so this guy now, let's put him here. Venom can attack and poison enemies. All right, let's, let's go with that. Not bad. Not bad at all. <clears throat> Fire, here, Jess is a mage. See a hero, she, I think it's a she. Yeah! All right, enemy turn. It's the enemy turn. Whoa. They didn't go for the mage. Wow, twice? Oh, more soldiers down there. Well, they do have a lot of movement rage. Damn, this game is hard! So, I guess I'm gonna move myself here and do the metal song again. So they can recover some health and buff up. Alright, so... Um, gotta protect that mage, huh? Ah, oh, it attacks both of them. That's awesome. Yeah, <laughs> way to go. Damn, this guy, we're gonna put him here. That way he will protect me, Jess, and attack this guy. This guy is the boss, obviously, the, the one with the uh, little ponytail or whatever. Damn, she almost died, man. Oh, no, 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 you're not doing this. What the fuck, man? How was I supposed to keep her alive? Does this game have permadeath? Mm. 
Yeah! Everybody in the, in the same range, within the range, gets attacked. That's cool. That's pretty cool. What about experience points? No, wait, that was a mistake. Can't believe Elite died. Man, the first boss of the game is overpowered, Sebastian. Oh man, why am I? I'm an idiot, I missed! How can I miss? Come on, man! There we go, I got him. 43 damage? Y your random number generator is kind of... Um, <laughs> kind of random. <laughs> Do some fire. Alright. And we got him. Yeah! <laughs> potion found, the rival tonic, potion, more potions. Eric is now level 3! Magic Sword learned. Magic Sword, that's a Super Nintendo game. Very good one. Spark learned. Heal learned. <laughs> He's the healer? Okay. <laughs> this game is very random. Oh, I gained another level. Only me. So Elite didn't level up because she was dead. But there's no permanent death, she's still there, that's cool. Sure we are, and your sister? Can someone explain to me what just happened? You guys threw me into a fight out of nowhere. Hey, I'm real sorry that you... That's... that song is from Chrono Cross. Hey, I'm really sorry that you got caught in all of that. My name is Ranzo. I'm so sorry for that. How's your name, by the way? How's my name? Give me what's my name? I'm Eric. Oh, I see. Well, pardon me for the small trouble I caused you. Small trouble? You call fighting some actual soldiers small trouble? Yeah, he's right, you know. I'm right. Oh, I'm sorry, Eric. Let me explain it. I and my brother, I mean, me and my brother are on a journey to recover an ancient item that was stole from your, stolen from my family. We tried to search at one of these general camps to see if there was any clues, if there were any clues about what we were looking for. And we stopped by to try and get some food and information and you were sleeping on the bar until we got ambushed. So I was teleported to a fantasy world. I know, let me compensate you. Would you like a free drink or something? Yeah, I don't drink. Drink? I don't even know where I am. <laughs> Hell yeah, that will help. It's not really useful. You know, I'm a pessimistic son of a bitch, so I'm gonna try to keep things real. It's not really useful. Plus, I don't drink anyway. Okay, you guys can help me out telling me where we are. We are in Gaiden. Gaiden, that's a reference to my book, Terra Gaiden, the first book I ever wrote in English. We are in Gaiden, currently on a nameless <laughs> The town doesn't have any name. <laughs> Year 1340 DC. What? <laughs> That's impossible. It must be a dream. Those blows did feel real. It's not a dream, so it means I'm stuck. Stuck, stuck at the final boss. That's another reference to one of my videos. <laughs> I'm not from here. I'm from another era. Wow, are you really from another era? Renzo, we will help him get home at least. The music stopped. It's probably looping. There we go. Okay, so how can we help you? Well, I have no idea. I will ask around here first, and then I think I'm just going to search in a bigger city. Makes sense. Maybe there I can find some clues. That's great, Eric. Let me accompany you to night 12 in that case. Night 12, night 12. We have to go there anyways. What a coincidence. And for sure, you will need our assistance. The plains and lands are full of bandits and monsters. It's hard to travel alone. That's why we hired a mercenary. I'm Jess, I'm traveling with them just for money, and that's it. <laughs> How honest. <laughs> I'm here for the money. I don't care about anything else. Well, I guess it's better than traveling alone. Okay, let's travel until I wake up, hopefully. Alright, <laughs> waking up, yeah, right, let's go. Let's go northeast for now. We have to reach Natwell City. Alright, if we find some soldiers along the way, 
We may deviate a bit. Just to let you know that you don't need to fight. You can wait for us in a safer place. Oh, I gotta buff you guys off with my metal song. I don't intend on fighting people unless it's for self-defense. Okay, let's go everybody. We have to cross a forest, a desert, and a plain field. Then we will be close to the city. Eric, we can also ask around the bar in case someone knows something. Okay, Renzo, thank you. Nice. What's going on here? No music? How can I say? Okay, save. Nice! Oh man, I lead still dead. We're gonna have to use a revival tonic. That's from Final Fantasy IX. Usually I try to buy some items before traveling, but you seem like a cool guy, so take this! Woohoo! Five potions! <laughs> Man, what a nice town! Haha, <laughs> the cat. You can buy items in here. Okay, thanks. This guy's gonna give me some something more. The Empire is getting very abusive. The other day they robbed an entire village. I will teach them a lesson! So do you wanna join us? Uh, no, I'm not very skilled at anything, but take some money. I'm, I'm in a good mood today. <laughs> 200 gold. Thanks, dude. Let's go back to the bar and talk to people. See what we learn. I can go back to the bar. Oh, I, can, I have to click. I love fruit juice. She loves fruit juice. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Canada? What's the pl- It sounds like a bit of- like a bird of some sort. Canada sounds like a bird. Well, Sebastian doesn't know that I'm back in Mexico, maybe. Well, by the time he made a game, I was already- I was still in Canada. Hey, nice beard! Oh, uh, thank you. I shaved today. Do you know that Natwell has the best drinks in all Gaiden? Really? Can I talk to the bunny, the bartender? Hey, come over here. Do you want a drink? No, thank you. But that's all? Oh, come on, more dialogue. Okay, let's go buy something here. Welcome to the item shop. Alright. Cheap armor. I, I gotta buy some, some of these, right? I'm gonna go with cheap armor. That's all I can afford. I'm gonna give her to her because, you know, she's level one, she didn't level up. There we go. Probably give her to, give this to, Jess has 39 defense points. Wait. 49. 37. So I'm just gonna give it to myself, I guess. I have 40. Not bad. Alright. Why? Okay, what else there? Oh, come on, Revival Tonic 300 gold? So you trying to read me off, man? I'm gonna save my money, thanks. <laughs> Alright, let's go. I can't afford anything else. <laughs> Alright. Let's save again. I guess, um... There's nothing hidden in the barrels. No items. What about there? It's locked. I guess it's time to go. To the overworld. The music takes a while to start. That's the forest from Final Fantasy IX. All right, let's talk to this guy. Hey, I'm reading a book called Código Morgana, Morgana Code. That's my book in Spanish. One of my many books in Spanish. 
it's great, you should give it a read. If you know how to read, of course. Okay, old man, take care out there. <laughs> yeah, I hope the monsters don't attack me when I'm relaxed reading here. <laughs> I'm gonna have to translate that book now. We're gonna go, ooh, two treasure chests. Nothing inside? Come on! Receive Ice Dagger. I guess I'm gonna have to equip now, I can't. I'm a magician. Yep, makes sense, right? Hey, so I'm gonna have to go back now, right? To sell the dagger. Maybe that dagger... Let's, let's, let's see who, who can use it besides. Kane. He also has the same dagger, okay, so... Just go back and try to buy some armor, sell the dagger. Awesome. I'm gonna buy... Well, I guess cheap armor for everybody. Yes, I can afford the other one now. Nice, everybody's properly equipped now. Wish I could have bought something more, but I guess we're good. Let's continue. I think there's another mission here. Be careful, Eric, we can encounter almost anything on these lands. Oh, bandits! And a goblin. Goblin seems to be their boss. All right, let's begin. Let's battle. I wonder what kind of music we'll play out now. It's your turn. I don't recognize that song. Oh, I can't go back? Come on! Wait, the song? That music sounds familiar, I just can't quite pinpoint it. The, uh, the metal song. Nice. And you got me there, Sebastian. I don't know that song, but it's, it sounds familiar. Yeah, enemies have a lot of movement range. Damn, he threw a stone at me. Motherfucker. Damn! They just love ganging up on Jess. I mean, Elif. Here we go. Kill this guy, can I do something besides buffing people? Yeah, oh, and I'm overpowered. Okay. Let's try luring these guys. We kind of have to. Oh, she's out of MP. Oh no, there's no one in range, so. All right. All right, Jess. We gotta protect each other. You're gonna have to protect me. All right, the enemy turn, play your enemy face. <laughs> so far, I have to admit, while the game has a, a few 
things that I'm not the biggest fan of, like the movement range is, is too too big. And the RNG makes no sense. <laughs> Everything else just seems fine. I'm enjoying this. For a one-man band, it's pretty darn decent. It's a hidden gem. Alright, so we're gonna have to go here. Do the fire burst so we can get all of these bastards. Yeah! Very well. Alright, we got them all. This looks dangerous. I don't think I'm very... I don't think I'm being very strategic today. Jesus, they're gonna gang up on her again. They do hate her, don't they? Why? You hate Ellie. You hate your own character, man. Why do you make everyone target her? Jesus. I guess I should have done this first. The metal song! Okay, we're gonna have to use the heal command now. See what happens. Heal. See how much it heals. Ah, oh, full HP! Ranso, my friend! I shouldn't do this, but I'm gonna risk it anyway. Probably take down the first guy. Only two guys left. Alright, it's the enemy turn. Stop ganging up on Elite, please. Jesus. They despise her. It's called aggro. You know, when everybody's ganging up on a character, that particular character has aggro. There we go, we got one. What about magic sword? Invokes a magic sword and slashes enemies three times? I wanna do that. Whoa, check out my character, man. He's so P as fuck. There we go! We got the boss. That victory theme... That victory theme, I can't recognize it. Got a bunch of magic waters. Everybody leveled up! Woohoo! Wow, what a fight that was! Let's continue! <laughs> Alright, let's save the game. Nice. I got a thunder dagger. And two potions. Okay. I'm gonna equip Renzo with a Thunder Dagger. Nice. Shall we go back to town? I mean, I didn't see a way to, uh, like, recover everything, to recover health. Like an Inn or something? Alright, out of water. Oh, there's a sign over there, all the way there. Right, Nate 12 city, left snowy mountains. Let's just go north. Let me advise you guys, the path to the city of Nate 12 is blocked. Why exactly? They said that they had received orders from General Guido to not let anyone pass. Guido? He was one of the generals who assaulted our village. Okay, Ali, let's go then. I'll help you guys out again. I'll help them again. I need to figure out what's happening. He won't let us pass if we stay here. Let's go, guys. Sure, partner. Oh, she's calling me a partner already. Cool. So, more treasure chests. Ah, seven potions. Well, there's no inn, but he sure gives a lot of freebies. 
cheap armor. Everybody has it already. Maybe I should go back to town and I don't know. What about these guys? Everything okay, traveler? Sure. Oh. They aren't very talkative, are, are they? They don't talk too much. So, um, right, na 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 12 city, left camp, right? Okay. What about north? Oh, it's blocked. Path blocked by orders of General Guido. Okay. Then let's go, um, right, it's to the... It's to the right of the character right now, but then if I do this, it's gonna it's gonna be on the left. Guido, we got you now. If both of you are, you were the one who assaulted our home. You better let us pass, prick. <laughs> you will pay, General Guido. Do you really want to sword play with me? I will cut all of you on half. You mean in half? <laughs> let's teach him a lesson. All right, let's bring it on. The boss battle. Battle start. It's your turn. Man, this looks tough as a matter of fact. Let, let me strategize here a little bit. We could um we could go all the way back and lure them in. But I you know we're too close. And since um their movement range is pretty far. Might as well just go all the way out. You're gonna gang up on me, but let's let's just do this. Hopefully, there's no permadeath. Thankfully, there's no permadeath. No, <laughs> that was a nice critical attack. Yeah! Oh, he didn't attack the others? Come on. Oh, he survived! Damn! Well, at least they're not gonna game up on me. Jesus. Let's do the metal song. I love the metal song, man. <laughs> it's awesome. I mean, maybe it should play some kind of metal. You know, for, not exactly an animation, maybe just a, a, a metal song, maybe my theme by the legendary Sultan. <laughs> when I cast that magic, that'll be bonkers. But it's okay, I mean, the, the attack, the spell itself is pretty damn good. Let's do some fire burst again so everybody can. Yeah, I got Guido! Got him! Nice! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Woohoo! Level up! Oof! He was strong! For sure he was! I'm out of breath. I would say he was an overrated general. <laughs> but yeah, tough as nails. My usual quotes. <laughs> Sweeter than music, man. Okay, so nothing here. Oh, they searched uh, the tent. Alright, so nothing here, and he is KO to answer anything right now. Okay, Elite, let's do the following. Me and Jess will guard Guido here until he wakes up, and we can interrogate him. And you and Eric can go ahead. Are you sure, brother? Yes, we must find out who assaulted our village. Not too far from here, after you get through the waterfall, Elliot, the Lancer, will we be waiting for you. Lancer! Both of you take care, we will see you guys later. Okay, Ranzo, take care and thank you. Take care out there and hope you find your home, Eric. <laughs> Thanks. Let's go, Elite. What's going on here, the waterfall? Ah, oh, Chrono Cross music. 
Hey, for some reason, I really like this place. Oh, really? Yeah, except for the thieves and scary animals, it's actually a nice place. I think exactly the same. So, Eric, do you remember now where is your home? I already told you. Jeez, it has no, it has no point telling her. Don't worry, I'll remember soon. That's great, I owe you one, so you can count on me. <laughs> Thank you, let's rest a bit here. This waterfall sure is beautiful, what do you say? Eric, are you okay? <laughs> yes, you're right, I almost... Uh, what, I'm asleep? I fell asleep. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go back to my room, to my house. What's going on now? You gotta be patient, now loading. Oh, the end? That's it. <laughs> that's the end of the first chapter. I, I'm pretty sure that's all he's got for now. Yep, that's it. That's it, people! That was Eric Landon RPG The Game. <laughs> it's pretty cool, it's pretty cool. I mean, the entire game, the entire episode was done with, by one guy. I mean, we could forgive, we can forgive the, uh, the RNG or the movement range, uh, the grammar mistakes, that's okay. I mean, maybe if this guy was working with, with somebody else, it would be better. I don't know. If you want to support Sebastian, go to the link below where you can download and play the game for absolutely free, free of charge, and you can also support the guy and give him some cash so he can hire an editor <laughs> to correct the grammar mistakes. <laughs> anyway, Sebastian, thank you very much, buddy, for making this. It's a good game. Uh, it can be improved, and if improved, it's probably going to be a very good, very solid game underrated obscure hidden gem that's all for today people thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe don't forget to donate and support the guy link in the description below play the game and have your own opinion about it thank you everyone see you next time